Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi, good evening. How are you? Hi, teacher. Hi. How's everybody Hello. today? Everybody okay? Yes, everybody. Yes. Thanks. Yes, Thank you. Very good. Nice. Yeah. All right, very good. Welcome, Julio, Miguel, uh, Jonathan, Idalia, Milcar, David, Lidia, Fatima. Daisy, Eric, Efraín, Veronica, Eugenia, and Armando. Very good. Nice group to begin with, guys. Thank you so much for being again in another class. So, as you know, this is the last class of this first week. Okay, so remember that tomorrow, although you want to have classes, we're not going to have classes. Okay, <laughs> so remember that we have classes from Monday through Thursday. So, tomorrow, you're off, and then Saturday and Sunday, I'll see you guys again on Monday. All right. So with that in mind, guys, uh, yesterday I told you that today is not going to be like such like grammar kind of class, all right? We're going to like talk a little bit about um, more like easy breezy kind of topic and we're talking about family today, all right? So I know, guys, because you're already on advanced level, you know all the family terms that we can think of. Let's share some ideas. Let's see, Daisy, can you tell me like a couple of family terms that you know from a family tree? What comes to your mind when we say family members? Give me one or two family members, Daisy, please. Hello. Hi. Good evening. Good evening. Um, my family is big. All right. Okay. Yeah, I, I read your comment. Also. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, okay. um, Daisy, can you right now? Can you just mention like two or three family members, like just to check on vocabulary that you guys probably know all of them, but that's okay. So we can just talk about it. Okay. Like mother, grandfather. Um, my, my mom and okay. my father. Okay, and your mom and father. All right. So we have. All right, so we have mother and father as like words. Very good. Can you think of any other family member, guys? Julio, can you tell me two more? No father, no mother anymore. Like two different ones. Sorry, teacher. Um, That's okay. Can you repeat me, please? I can hear you very well, Julio. Yeah, I, I, have, I have problems now, teacher. If you wanna. Okay, 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 that's okay. Very good. Jonathan, tell me two more family members besides mother and father. What else, who else can we think of? Jonathan. Your microphone is off, Jonathan. Brother, sister, uncle. All right, okay, stop it right there. Very good. I know you know them all. Very good. Idalia, can you tell me two more? Then Eugenia, maybe Amilcar. Uh huh. Okay, hi, good evening. Yeah. My sister, cousins, my grandparents. Grandparents, very good. Okay. All right, very good. Joseph, what about you? Amilcar, can you tell us like some more? Okay, my niece, my nephew, my cousin. Your cousins, all right, very good. Wow, there's like a loud noise over there. All right, very good. Thank you, Joseph. What about Amilcar? Wow. Can you share some other with us? Oh, my, for example, mother-in-law. Your mother-in-law. Very good. So mother-in-law, father-in-law. Very good. All right. How do you, you guys, how, how do we say um, or padrino? Anybody? That's a good, good father. Good father. Good father, good mother. So Efrain, yes, if Stephane. you're my godfather, yeah. what am I for you? Oh, well, you were my... My goddaughter. The goddaughter. Very good. Nice. Very good. Okay. Very good. Then we can mention like a step sister, a step brother. Right. Okay. What else? Anything yes, yes. else, guys? Husband. Husband. Yes. All right. And if you I have, have husband. My husband, yes, you have a husband. Then your husband has yeah. siblings. Siblings. Very good. Uh, All right. All right. Very good. What else? Great grandparents. Great grandparents, like your great grandmother, your great grandfather, or great 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 grandfather. All right, so we can go all the great ones. Stepfather. Back. Excuse me. So we have also a stepfather, stepfather, That's right. stepmother. We have. We can have a step stepmother, a step siblings. All right, step brother, step sister. Yes, of course. Very good. What else? Anything else, guys, that we can think of? 
Now, let's say that you are going to get married, all right? So she or he becomes your what? Your uh, wife and husband. Right, right. once you Nine get months? married, yes. When you get married, they become your husband or your wife. But on the process of oh, getting yeah, yeah, married... No, no. That's a boyfriend or, boyfriend or girlfriend? Okay, so girlfriend. yeah, that's the first fiance. step of Efrain. It's the girlfriend and boyfriend. Oh, sorry, and then sorry, it's sorry, the fiancé. So. All right, yeah. very oh, good. Yes, the fiance, right. Very nice. Yes, so yes, when yes. you, for example, guys, when you um, ask your girlfriend or your boyfriend to marry you, then you say, oh, now I am what? I am... Engaged. Engaged. Okay. Very good. Right. I'm engaged. All right. Now, what happens when you got married, you were happy, but suddenly you're not so happy anymore? And then you have to what? Separate. Yeah, you separate and then you get... Divorced. 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 All right. You get divorced. Very good. Now, what happens when something that you don't want it to happen, but your wife or your husband passes away. Then you become a what? Widow. A widow. widow. All right, very good, all right. So uh, who's single in class from this group? Who is single, but really single? Don't lie to me. All right, Ivali is single. All right, I'm like who super single? single. <laughs> Excuse me, Miguel? I'm single. I'm like super single. Ah, all right. <laughs> All right, very good. Who else is single? Amilka, you're single. I'm a single alum. <laughs> all right, all right. Pinky, yeah. promise, guys, that you're single. All right, very good. Okay. Um, who's married in class from this group? Who's married? That's me. Efrain, okay. Me too. Yes, yes. Good. Yes. Who else is married? All right, Jonathan, very nice. <laughs> Julio? No, no puede hablar, pero si puede decir. Yes or no. <laughs> <laughs> Uh -huh. Julio, you're married or not? All right, I cannot really hear you. Okay, so what happens, guys? So how do we call when, for example, we are not married yet, but we live together? How do you say that? How do you call that kind of relationship? Hi, anybody? Uh huh, Jonathan. What do you? How do you say it? Jonathan? I was talking to Julio. Oh, what happened? What, what did Julio say? I didn't listen. I... Hey. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. All right. Yeah. Partner? Ah. You can say he's my partner, but... If we're working Hola. together, you're my partner. Hola. So, but that doesn't mean Hola. that that kind of relationship Hola. that is not. Oh, Julio, I can hear you a little bit better now. It's free union. Free union. You can say we live in free union. All right. So when we're not married but we live together, we live in free union. All right. But you can say you're that's your husband, that's your wife, and that's okay. All right. Any other any other um, term related to family or to like relationships that you guys know and you want to share with us? No, we're okay, right? With all those children and all that. All right. Remember, and this I know, guys, that you know this, but remember that children is for plural, so don't ever say childrens. All right. Sometimes still make that small mistake which is not that small but anyway or you can say child or kids all right when you say oh how many kids do you have and you have you say three or four or five or one all right who has children in this group who's got children all right julio you got children miguel not children no all right jonathan you have two children yeah what happened jonathan no joseph no Joseph, you got two children, and Jonathan, no, zero, no children. All right, okay, very good, okay. Fatima, do you have children? No, I am single. Excellent, Fatima, just double checking, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right, very good. Lydia, are you married? No, I'm single. You're single. All right. Okay. Yes. So now what happens on how, or how do you say when you are not married, but you're single, but you are 
a mom or you're a dad. How do you call that term, guys? Single mom? Yeah, single a single mom. mom, a single dad, or a single parent, okay? For example, I have, uh, have a baby or I have two babies, but I'm not with my, I don't know, with a couple or the guy, so I say I'm a single mom, all right? I'm, I'm a single, single mother, all right? Or I'm a single parent, okay? When, what happens when it's only you as a child? How do you say that, guys? I am the what? Only child. I am the only child. Miguel, are you the only child in your family? Yeah, yes. are you spoiled, Miguel? You can be both spoiled and you can have too much attention for yourself. All right, okay, all right, very good. Okay, anybody else is an only child? Edwin, are you an only child or you had more sisters and brothers? All right. Oh, okay. Very good. All right. What about Idalia? Are you a single child or you got sisters and brothers? No, I got sister. All right. Okay. All right. Very good. So guys, I'm not really gonna like, we're not gonna keep on like talking about family terms because you pretty much know all of them. So I'm going to quickly um, just show you this here. All right. So, um, Family terms is not very complicated. Here we have um, a small family tree here. So you just can see the words. We're not really gonna like talk much about it. You will do the talking in your groups today. All right, so we say mother, brother, sister-in-law, son, husband, nephew, granddad or grandpa or grand, right? Grand, uh, daughter-in-law, sister, father-in-law, daughter, all the in-law family, all right, grandma, brother-in-law, wife, granddaughter, niece, cousin, father, and all those. And of course, there are many more. All right. Now, um, I just want you guys to do this. We're going to do two activities today. All right. So I'm just, I just want to explain to you this one. Oh, you know what? I'm going to send to you. Hold on. Yeah. I'm going to send to you the, the, uh, this presentation but you can take pictures anyway from it. Just give me a second here. I'm just gonna send it to you. I'm gonna send two files, all right? And I want you to like take a look at both files here. Okay, this is the, okay. There guys, I'm gonna send it to you right away. All right, so it's just, all right. I think it just went through, okay. So, but right now, what I want you to do is this. Can you, um, can you guys help me here with completing the sentence according to the picture? We have the Simpsons family. All right, so, um, Miguel, can you read number one and finish it up for me, please? Lisa is Bart's wife. Lisa is, Bart, is Bart's sisters. sisters. All right, his sister, right, very good. All right, um, Abraham is Lisa's what, guys? Grandfather. Abraham is Lisa's grandpa. Very good. All right. What about number three? Who wants to do number three? Clancy is Selma's what? Father. Is Selma's father. All right. Okay. What about five? Guys, anybody? Uh, Uncle. All right. Okay. Very good. Okay. This is what we're going to do, guys. Just give me one quick second, uh, please. Just give me one second. Quien tiene un gecko? All right, sorry guys, I'm sorry. Okay, so let's see, we were uh, talking about, what about five, did we do five or six? We finished five or six, guys? Five. All right, so Herb is, uh, Herb is Bart's what we said? Uncle. All right, okay. Okay, very good. What about six? Betty, I mean, party is Lisa's? Aunt. Aunt, yes, all right, very good. Jackie is Ling's son. Grandmother. Grandma. Oh. Grandma, right? Yes, probably. All right. Herb is Homer's what? 
Brother. The brother? Well, believe it or not, I've never seen The Simpsons, so I don't know. <laughs> what about uh, number nine? Herb is Maggie's what? Uncle. Uncle. All right. And the last one, Ling is Bart's? Cousin. 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 All right. Very good. Okay. Uh, we're going to do this, guys. I already sent the presentation to you on another file. This is what we're going to do. I'm going to send you to your groups right now because I want you to do the talking in your groups. All right. And you have these um, questions in the PPT. I don't know if everybody's able to open up the PPT I just sent. Can you guys open it up? Can you check if you can open it? And let me know, I, please. I just need to send it to my computer. <laughs> okay, all right. If not, guys, you may take a picture right now. Okay, I think it's like four pictures. So Where if did you, cannot, you send it? I already sent it to the uh, group, to the WhatsApp group. Yeah, I already sent it. I actually sent two files. The first one is the PPT and the other one is a, a Word document. I got it. You got it? All right. I can see. You guys got it? Yeah. All right. Okay. Very good. In case you didn't, you can take a picture of this. So what I want you to do is the following. I'm going to send you to your groups and I want you, like, for example, if I'm working with Eric, uh, Eric, we, I mean, he reads number one, but we come up with the, the uh, we share the answers or we like discuss the answer. Then I read number two and then we solve it together. We go on with three, four and five the same way. Then we have another exercise, all right? Read the instructions, they are there, and then follow, like keep on working the same way with these other five questions. And last, we have exercise three, and you have this picture. Into this picture, you're going to answer these questions, okay? Once you're finished, what I want you to do is I want you to open up the other file, which I'm gonna, I'm gonna show to you right now, which is a Word document, okay? Um, if, once you open it, guys, you shouldn't have a problem because it's a Word document. On the first page, it says a student A, the second page, it says a student B, and in case you're working in groups of three, then it says a student C. These questions are for you to practice your speaking, all right? Uh, some of you told me at the very beginning of the course that sometimes you don't practice much uh, with anybody all right so here's the opportunity for you to practice your speaking okay so if for example i'm working with um idalia once we're in the group idalia we are going to decide who's going to be student a and who's going to be student b all right so i ask you the questions you may ask all of them if you want but remember that the idea is for um for me and idalia to have a chance to speak so let's go like take turns. I ask her one question and then she asks me another question. If we have three people in a group, then we take turns. Like everyone asks one question and then we go on in circles. You understand what we're going to do? Guys, yes? All right. Uh, question. So, yes, what's your question? I mean, uh, right now we are working on the first PPT. Yeah, right now I'm working on the PPT with the, third, the, uh, the first three exercises, okay? Okay. And then when, once you finish, you may open up the other file, which is a Word document. And then just um, the idea is for you to practice your speaking, all right? Asking questions and giving answers. Make sure that your answers are not very long so everybody gets a chance to practice, yes? Okay. So I'm gonna be coming in the groups. I wanna hear you speaking. I wanna hear you reading, all right? So this is like, take advantage of this half an hour, a little bit more for you to practice your speaking, all right? To this level, you shouldn't have any problem with those questions, okay? Got it? Guys, got it? Yes, hello, yeah? Okay, <laughs> very good. Okay, I'm gonna send you to the groups right now. All right, pr probably there's gonna be one group with three people in it, all right? You may start clicking on your groups.
feet. A person who has finished growing and growing and is not longer and is not longer a child. B. A man who has never been married. Uh, I think I, that is C. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Ellie, can you read the second? Yeah. Um, what is the definition of divorce? Uh, to be no longer married to your wife or husband? A group of people who are related by blood or marriage? I have heard it used. Teacher. Hi. Can you explain Hi. us um, the second part of the question number three? What letter C means or how can we use it? It's on that it's usually used as... Hold on, just give me a second. Um, uh, right. You're doing which part right now? Exercise number two. Oh, part two. Uh, on the PPT? Number three. Yeah, yes. Yeah. This one right here, which, uh, which description? Will be... No, is this one? This, yeah. this, uh-huh. No longer alive uh, to be dead. And I think it's late because you usually say that his late husband, her late husband, I mean, or so on. All right, yeah, it's late. But what is the meaning for like like in this passed context? away? Yeah, like oh. in uh, it's another way to say, like you know how in in Spanish we say finado. On those synonyms, weird synonyms that we use to call people that they passed away. Yep. All right. So in this case, yeah. you can say like. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I didn't know it. <laughs> yeah, I know. Not many people Me do. <laughs> All right. Okay. Nice. So number four. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks. Yep. What's the meaning on a following definition? The father of your mother or father, same as grandpa. Grandfather. Hi, Efrain. Oh. Hi, Joseph. How are you doing? Hi, teacher. Hello. Ah. Hello. You doing okay? <laughs> cool. All right. <laughs> okay. Okay, very nice. You're working. That's good. Okay. Keep it up. Okay. Hi, Armando. Hi, Eugenia. Hi, teacher. Hi. Are you working okay? Yes, yes we yes. are right. already on exercise. Three. And the one yes. of the correct meaning. Okay, all right, very nice. Thank you. You're welcome. Student. Uh... Hi, Daisy. Hi, Edwin. Hi, teacher. Hi. Hi. Are you working okay? Any questions? No. You're doing okay? You're doing fine? All, all is okay, yes. Excellent. Very nice. Thank yes, you. Yes. All Thank right, you, guys. Teacher. All right. Teacher. If you need anything, let me know, okay? Yes. Okay, okay teacher. Thank you. You're welcome. Everyone. Okay. Cool. You, I can okay. hear you now. Yeah, I have problems with my mic. Sorry. Ah, uh, no, that's okay. That's okay. All right. Veronica, any questions or you guys I are doing okay? Yeah? Everything fine? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, guys. All right. Nice. If okay. you have any questions, let me know, okay? Okay. okay. We'll let you know. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. It's your time. The one that it says. Ah, what is the meaning of the following definition that this is the next one okay. 
exercise two. Yeah, grandfather. Hi, Jonathan. Hello, Fatima. Hello Hi. What's Hi. up? Hi. Welcome. Thank to you. The jungle. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> How are you All doing? Right. Any questions? No, you're doing okay. So far, so yeah. good. All right. But a girl or a woman who has the same parents as you could be your sister or your twin. Let her be both. To me. <laughs> Where are what you? What is the difference in, in, in um, in twin? Number six of the presentation. Number six of oh, question two. Oh, hold on. Let me. Oops. Where did I? Hold on. Guys. Slide number six and uh, question number two. Inside, I mean, what is the meaning of the following definition? A girl or woman who has the same parents as you? Mm -hmm. I guess your it could sister, be sister it can be your twin. twin. Both. Yeah. Yeah, both make sense. Twins for me is when you have an identical. Right, but in this case, it's not really saying that you're not identical. They're just yeah. saying a girl or a woman who has the same parents as you. But in this case, could be sister because you're talking about yeah. a woman. Yeah, sister. Probably would be like there is better. not the, uh, additional information. To yeah, yeah, use. you're right. Yeah, David, you're right. Very good. So number five. What is the meaning of the following definition? A drawing that shows that the names.
baking. Oh, no, baking. Bake, baking. Yeah. Baking But, quesadillas. <laughs> Who's baking quesadillas? <laughs> oh my goodness, guys. Don't mention food. I'm hungry. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, and I, I mean, I have another class after yours, and I had one before. So I have to like eat very early supper. <laughs> It's because we're talking about mom, so you know they are yes. great chefs. Right, of course we are. <laughs> But I'm the one who cooks here. <laughs> All right. So how did you guys find out yeah. about these classes? Mom found it. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, really? Really? <laughs> <laughs> talking about moms. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> Number two, talking about. Actually, I was on Facebook uh, scrolling down and then I find uh, the promo. So I got into mm. and then they contact me. So okay. that's why I'm here. All right. Cool. What nice. about you, Amilcar? Yeah, YouTube, tell us, Amilcar. Facebook. Yeah. Okay. Facebook. Right. Yeah. Call it Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right. Okay. So where are you working now? Where, where are you on the task? Are you on the questions already? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. We're on the document on Word and mm -hmm. we are on number four questions. Okay. All right. We're doing one to one. Like That's three. right. Yeah. That's the best way to go okay. about because, I mean, there are three of you. So, yeah, everybody gets a chance to speak and then to, 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 to uh, ask. Very yeah. good. So it's your turn, my, my Miguel, Michelangelo. Emergency. Emergency. Uh, emergency. Emergency. Yeah. Emergency. Mm -hmm. Or something that. Well, hello again. Hello again. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Hi, Fatima. Hey, a question. Uh huh. What's your question? <laughs> Why do people get married? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Married. I am married and I'm actually happily married, but I don't know, I guess because... But a lot of people is not happy about being married. I know, that's true, but then you, I don't know, then let's ask them, why did they get married in the first place? That's I guess part of the the... they were married, I mean, they were happily married, but then something happened and they're not happy anymore. What, what pushed the people to say, okay, we need a, a legal document to... I don't to know. tell us to stay together. I don't know. So, in uh, Jonathan, you're not married. Oh, yeah, I'm married. <laughs> I'm happily married. <laughs> so I you don't answer the question. Why? <laughs> I don't know why people married. All right, okay. David, are you married? No, yet. No, But yet. I'm thinking <laughs> about it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. What I'm about Fatima? Fatima? Are you thinking about it? Yeah, I won. Oh, uh, you see. Ah. Yeah. Oh, that's nice a sweet summer child. Someday in the future. <laughs> yes, of course, Fatima. Yeah, so, very nice. <laughs> you have your crush, Fatima. You have your crush. Of course, she probably Why? does. <laughs> <laughs> But you know what, Fatima? Don't say it because remember that these classes, they are on YouTube. So you don't want the whole world yeah. to know. That's yeah. why I don't show my webcam. No, just kidding. I don't have. Uh, uh, I'm yeah. using a desktop. All right, I get it, David. That's okay. And don't worry about it. <laughs> All right, very good. All right, cool. Keep okay. on talking. You're working. I'll go. <laughs> <laughs> don't ask me difficult questions, Jonathan. <laughs> Is it not difficult? No, I'm kidding. There gets married and I have to do that. I have to clean the house in the morning. If I want to do exercise, I have to clean the house. Uh, okay, that and I have to wash the dishes. Yeah. Ho ho. Yeah. <laughs> What about you? Ellie. I am a child. His only work is do his homework. His years old so um i don't know if guys in some work oh yes. he does have 
to do his homework. Yeah, a lot of but, homework. Yeah, but that's a chore, I think. It is. <laughs> yeah. Okay, in my case, uh, I don't have child, but uh, me and my sister, since we were shy, since we were shy, sorry. We were children? Uh, mm -hmm. We have to war with my parents, and, and my dad has, has a restaurant, and my mom has like a store in the, in the mercado. The market. So, uh, yeah, it's okay. in the market, but. Hi, Our friend, Hi Efrain. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Are you asking um, questions already? Yes, we're working Excellent. on that right now. Very good. Yes. Okay. And <laughs> Thank you, Thank Joseph. You. Oh, yeah, Thank there you. you go. I see it. All right. You have <laughs> enough to talk about. Yeah, of course. That's the idea. <laughs> okay. The Thank student. You. Ah, okay. Are friends more important than family? What do you think? They. Watch TV, uh, the cell phone. I don't know. No sé qué más. Okay. Sí, como no vivo con ellos, entonces no. Pero sí he escuchado que sí, a veces corta la grama y otras cosas, ¿verdad? Pero en tiempo libre, bueno, como no. Entonces digo, tiempo libre.
Hi, Jonathan. <laughs> All right. We're just going to wait for everybody to get back. Oh, it's time. Yeah, it's time. <laughs> Unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> I know. You're one minute late. I know. <laughs> All right. But I know you guys are like really busy talking. That's why I gave you one more minute. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Very good. You see, no, not everybody's back yet because they are talking away. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right, guys. So, um, as I said at the very beginning, today is the last class of the week. We don't have classes tomorrow. All right. Uh, we'll have classes until Monday. Okay. So, thank you so much for being one week with me. And I do want to say thank you because most of you have been like with us the whole week. All right. So that's the very, very good. Okay. That's the way it should be. All right. And as you notice, the week went like by flying and it's going to happen the same way for the other three more weeks that we have ahead of us. All right. So thank you so much. Thank you for sharing. Um, I sent already the PPT for this class as well as the questions. They are there for you to like either like you can keep on using them or talking with anybody or just kind of like answer them to yourself. The idea is for you to practice it, all right? So thank you so much and I'll see you on Monday. Please be safe. If you don't have to go out, don't go out and stay home and work, all right? So thank you guys. Have a nice weekend. Bye. 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 Bye.